There's a lot of talk about big data and how we can use data to make better decisions. And when we think about data, we think about how can we use it online to make our digital more effective. But the reality is that data can actually help our offline efforts just as much as our online. And I want to break down for you three areas you should be using and thinking about data to make better decisions offline. The first is product development. There's so much data out there on Google as well as other platforms to see what products are being searched for, what is popular, and how that can influence the products that come out of your market. I was interviewing a manufacturer recently who was sharing that they were trying to figure out what products they should develop within the door category. And the first place they started was Google. They started to look into what people were searching for, whether that was colors or finishes or types of products that their audience is looking for, the first place they went was online because it's real-time information. The second area is supply chain. Not a very exciting area to talk about, but the beauty of data online is you should be able to predict and understand what kind of demand you're gonna have with your products six, 12, even 18 months from now if you're using the leading indicators on your site to understand what kind of demand is coming down the pipeline. So let's say you sell in the commercial space and you sell cladding. You know your sales cycle is 12 to 18 months. If you're looking at the leading indicators on your site from a lead gen standpoint, awareness standpoint, even traffic growth standpoint, you look at that, you should be able to figure out where people are going to be converting and what kind of projects you have coming down the pike so that you can be planning for that from a manufacturing standpoint. The third area, and this is the area I get the most excited about, is competitive insights and honestly even gaps in the marketplace. And this is where you have to go off of your own data and start looking at other competitors' data, whether you're using Google or you're using tools like SEMrush or other websites that provide competitive insights. You can see where are they spending money, where is their demand that your audience is looking for information and they're not getting it, and then how can you exploit that, not only within your marketing, but your product development, your supply chain, within other aspects of your overall production. It is critical to be using data to think about decisions, not only online with your digital, but also your offline. And those are three key areas that you should be able to do, work today, and figure out how can you use that to make better decisions.